Hello everyone, I hope you all are doing great. Now this is a supplement video to the first lesson dilation of module 3. The reason I'm doing this video is when I was doing this lesson in my class, one of my students, Omar Kalfan, showed me a very very easy and a simple method to solve this problem. Uh, the example 4 problem which is kind of lengthy so that's why I'm doing this with that shortcut video uh, in order to watch the entire video explanation please watch the previous video in this playlist that is the entire lesson explanation for this first lesson dilation now in this one I will quickly solve example 4 in an easier and a shortcut method now we, we remember if you have watched the previous video remember scale factor in order to find it you just divide the distances the dilated distance the dilated image distance divided by the original image that is the formula now if you know the value of say k is the scale factor always you just take a dash b dash divided by say a and b this is what we have done but instead of taking uh, any distance any side length we can just take coordinates how about this we can just take this much and then we can again make it equated to b dash or b or c dash or c so now this is very important why because instead of finding the distance using distance formula and then dividing it, dividing it up, just choose a coordinate. Over here, I can choose any coordinate. I'll just choose A. Any one is enough. A coordinate. What is A dash value over here, right? What is that value? So A dash is basically, from here you need to count. This is 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So it's minus 9. X value is minus 9. What about the Y value? Y value is 0. That is the coordinate. Now the same thing you need to find it for A. That is minus 3 and 0. So all you need to do is substitute over here. What is A dash? A dash is minus 9. And since it's 0, you can just ignore it. And over here it's minus 3. The answer is positive 3. This is the scale factor. This is it. Now you can try it for all the other coordinates as well. You will get the answer. But one important thing when you're solving you need to solve x coordinate and y coordinate separately. Let me repeat it. Now say for example, let me do the c point over here. c dash and c, right? So what is c dash value? It's negative 3 and 3, 6, 9. So this is going to be minus 3 and 9. And what about c? It will be minus 1 and positive 3. Okay, it's upward 3. So here, if I'm just solving for C dash, it'll be minus 3 divided by minus 1. Do the X coordinates separately. This is 3. And the Y coordinates separately, 9 divided by 3, it's 3. So you can see the scale factor is repeating always as 3, 3, and 3. So this is very easy to solve because if you just find the coordinate and then solve it, you will get the uh, answer for the scale factor. Now, here we have done the distance, but whatever you do, ultimate answer is going to be same. So that's why this is very easy. So instead of all the trouble of finding the distance using distance formula, just find the coordinates. Let's quickly do it over here as well. I'll just take any one point. Say now I will just take say this point. I mean, it's better to go with these. They're easy, but let me take F because it has X and Y. And you, you please do try it for the other points. Now this one over here is positive 2 comma 3. And what about this? It is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 comma 3, 6, 9 I believe. Yes, nine. So now all you need to do is here, uh, let's write k equals f dash by f always it's the dilated image divided by the original image now x coordinate and y coordinate separately x coordinate is 6 by 2 that is 3 oh sorry this is the dilated image it's 2 by 6 so let me just rewrite it 
Now, always remember it's the dilated image divided by the original image. So it is 2 divided by 6, that is 2 1 times and 3 times over here. So it's 1 thirds. Okay, sorry for that. Okay, this is the answer. It is 1 thirds. And now what about the other one? Y coordinate. It will be 3 divided by 9. 3 goes in it. It's 1 by 3. And this is the answer. It's one third and one third. So the scale factor over here will be one third or 0 0.33. So this is how you can easily solve for the scale factor when you have a, a original and di original and dilated image. So I hope this is helpful and this is easy. So please do watch the previous video for the entire in-depth explanation. This is just for the example four and the check four. Thank you for watching and please do stay tuned for the next video for the next lesson. Bye-bye for now.